Coach Andy Van Fossen, what a game, Coach. Uh, just coaching in that thing, big at bats, base runners all over the place. What was it like? Oh, it was a fun environment. I, you know, we've it, when we play trainer, it, it's like this most of the time. You know, last year's game was kind of ugly, but we still, you know, we were able to. Um, <laughs> We were able to to get one, you know make one more play tonight, and they were able to make one more play last year. So, um, you know, it was it, it's a it's a fun environment. You know, the crowd was into it, kids were into it. Um, like I said, we were able to make one more play, and and uh, you know that was it. Zach has been huge for you all year. Big big outing on Tuesday. He comes in in relief and pretty much shut him down. Yeah, he's he's kind of our I don't want to say our secret weapon because people know about him, but I mean he pumps strikes. Um, you know, after the kid got. Uh, uh, or walked, I don't remember what happened, but he, the kid walked and walked out and talked to him, and, and he just said, uh, I go, you know, just forget, oh, yeah. I mean, so it, that, that's how he is all the time. Um, you know, he's a good kid. Uh, you know, all of, our, all of our kids worked hard, and, and it was one of those, I think, we, we deserve this. Um, we've worked for it. Um, you, know, you know, if I'm Bob, I, you know, you, you don't want to go out like this, but what can you say about his program that he's got here? Um, I mean, it's there, there's not many there's not many adjectives you can use to to do what to to say what he's been able to build here and um, you know wish him nothing but the best down in down in Arizona but um, but we'll come to practice tomorrow and and get ready for Tuesday. Yeah, I talked with Zach and Tyler there and they you know kind of talked about last year and how the season was ended by trainer at their home park and how you know they really wanted to kind of reverse that yeah. the, the, what that meant to them yeah we talked about that uh actually tuesday night you know we said everything lined up the same um you know we're coming to their place district finals last year they came to our place um i think this year was, or this game was a lot cleaner at least in in the middle innings um but yeah i mean that's you know like people said when you're dealing with 15, 16, 17, 18 year old kids, you know, not only do you take into account the, the emotion and stuff, but the, the cult, the environment and things like that. And, and our kids were able to step up tonight and I'm really, really proud of them. Um, it looks like maybe Alta really at this point, they're up, I think, seven runs in the seventh or something like that. I mean, you, your thoughts on just, you know, just getting a chance to play for that. Um, you know, I think this time of year, you know, it's pitching and defense, but also if you get hot at the right time and, and uh, you know, hinton has been on a roll this year and, uh, it sounds like you know Alta really is you know putting some some good games, good at bats together. So um, we'll sit down and figure out you know what we're going to do on Tuesday, but uh, we'll do so our same routine tomorrow and, and Monday, and and uh, get on the bus and go to Harlan. Congrats, Coach. Thanks a lot. All right, thank you. All right, Tyler Boothby here. He had the go ahead RBI double, and then. Kind of a heads up base running uh, play from a cleanup hitter there. Tell me about uh, tell me about that double you hit. I mean, Christensen ran a long, long way there. Uh, no other center field in the lake is getting that, to that ball, but Christian made a heck of a play on it. I mean, he was so close. Uh, Blake made a heck of a dive at the plate. I mean, that's just that's just baseball. I mean, he drops it like that. It's just baseball, man. You uh, coming around third base there? Tell me what what you saw on that play. Uh, I had to unplow the hitch, uh, get my legs going. Uh, Andy was screaming at me to go home. I saw Schumacher at the plate, and I just got my hand around the tag. That obviously turned out to be a pretty big run there for you guys. What was it like playing in this game tonight, an in insane game? Yep. Uh, last year, they beat us at our place. This year, it feels pretty good to beat them at their place. What's it mean for you guys to just get it another inch closer? I know you guys have, have big goals, bigger goals than this, but uh, one went away. Yep, one game at a time, I mean. This team's pretty special. Congratulations, team. Thank you. It was Zach Teton. Zach, you come in relief, and uh, you kind of, you know, you shut him down to that last run came across. Tell me a little bit about uh, tonight, what was working well. Uh, I was just trying to pump strikes. My two seam was working pretty well, getting some nice ground balls, and the defense made some great plays there, too. Coming off the outing you had on Tuesday, and you, I mean you've had a lot of great outings this year, but tell me how your confidence, how you, your, where your confidence was coming into that, coming off of Tuesday. I was feeling pretty good, you know, just trying to do the same thing, just pump strikes. How about uh, this game, pitching in huge moments, base runners all over the place. How were you able to keep your head and continue to work out of some trouble? I just trusted my defense. I knew that they were going to make plays. How about that last play? Kind of take me through that a little bit and what you saw. As a hit right up the middle, I just tried to back up the play at home and see Blake cut it off and get that guy at second. It was it was pretty great. What's it mean to you to, to uh, get a win over this trainer team, team that ended your season last year? 
feels nice to get some revenge. You know, they beat us at our place, so it feels good to beat it them here. Congratulations to you. Good luck Tuesday. Thank you.